friends, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Mary and it's time for another SP roleplay video. I've had a lot of caffeine, guys. You just, you're getting extra merry today. You're getting extra merry. We're gonna deal with it. We're gonna get through this together. But if this is your first time finding one of my videos, these SP, SP roleplay videos are a tool that I use to help get you guys into your end state. So this is going to be an interactive one where you and I are going to role play. We're going to pretend that maybe we're on the phone, maybe we're in person, however you want to, however you want to role play it. But I'm going to be talking to you about a hot date that you and your SP just went on. I want you dishing the details to me because we're in the end state. You and SP are together. You are in your happily ever after. And so obviously you guys are having date nights. I want to hear about it. I want the details. I want the 411. So I'm going to so I'm going to ask you questions, give you prompts, and I will pause while I wait for you to respond to them. Whenever I'm about to start speaking again, I may nod my head or give a little mm hmm or a wow or whatever. I'm going to give you a prompt that indicates to you that I'm about to stop talking again. So if you're still talking, you know to kind of like wrap it up because I'm going to start my part again. And then that makes the conversation feel and flow a little more naturally. So um, these videos have been a big hit. I kind of just made my first one a couple months ago on a whim and you guys seem to really enjoy them. It seems to really help with placing you in the end state. So for today, you and I, we're just friends, we're besties, just like any other day. And I wanna know about your date that you just went on with your SP, which a boo thing, because they're not an SP anymore, they're your boo. So um, I'm not gonna do an outro for this video. I want the conversation to feel really natural. So if you end up join, enjoying this video, enjoying this SP role play, please be sure to show me I did a good job by clicking the like button. Give me a little love for the YouTube algorithm. And if you also drop a comment below, let me know how you enjoyed the video. If you have requests for future role play videos, then that'll also help me with the algorithm as well. So I can continue making content like this for you guys. So let's just, Let's jump right in. Hey, oh my God. So I've been trying to get in touch with you forever. How have you been? Yeah, yeah, th things have been really busy. Things have been really crazy over here too. Uh, my husband just got back from deployment, I'm sure you heard. And so obviously I've been really, really busy with that. <laughs> you know, I missed him like crazy this year. So um, we've been going out and hanging out a lot, spending time together doing what husband and wife do. Um, I saw that you and your boo went on a really hot date recently. How was that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, and, and was that like a total surprise? Was it like a surprise date or is that something that you guys planned together? Mm hmm. Oh, I'm sure that felt so good. So and so did they pick the spot for you to go to or did like did they pick it or did you pick it or like do you guys take turns? Because I know like my husband and I, we take turns picking the spot. So did they pick this one for you or did you guys pick it out together? Mm. Oh my God. Yeah. And I'm sure, I'm sure it felt really magical too. I mean, that just sounds like a really romantic and fun way to spend the night together. Right. Yeah. And was that your first time going there? Yeah. Yeah. So, and remind me, like at this point, how many dates have you guys been on now? Oh, oh, okay. That's, that's really exciting. So what are you think? So where are you thinking you want to go for next time? Cause that sounds like really cool, really cool, romantic, fun, awesome date. Um, do you want your next date to be like paddle boating or scuba diving or something really small and intimate? Like, what are you thinking for the next big date that you guys go on? Mm. 
oh, oh okay yeah wow that's that sounds really cool it sounds like you guys have a lot of really fun dates in the works and everything so as far as the relationship is going it sounds like it's going good because you're you're going out so much um how's everything going with the with the relationship now Yeah. Wow, that yeah, that must feel that must feel incredible because I know that this is something that you were really wanting and you were cultivating and you were working on yourself to manifest this. So, do they know that you actually manifested all of this or should I like keep it top secret whenever I see you guys? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. My, my husband knows I manifested him, but he doesn't really believe in like LOA stuff. And so whenever I say like, Oh, I manifested this, he's like, okay, yeah, sure. Weirdo. So it doesn't really bother him, but like, I understand like people feel differently. So if you want me to keep it under, under wraps, then I will. Or if you want me to just talk about it, then I will, you know, I'm just like, whatever you want me to do. So, so when the date, when the date was over, like what what happened next unless it was like you know TMI then don't don't tell me too much but like how did how did things go at the end of the night once the date was over what did you guys do when, like after you left yeah yeah, and, and so, like, since then, have they been, like, reaching out to you more, texting you throughout the day, calling you, stuff like that? Because I know it's, it's so funny because, like, in my case, like, with my husband, um, whenever we were going through our breakups, he was kind of standoffish because he was still kind of sorting things out in his head. And now that our relationship is in the place that it is, you know, even though we're married and he sees me every day, um, whenever we have, like, a really nice romantic evening together... Um, I swear he's like just blowing up my phone afterwards. Are they like texting you right now or like how, how have things been since the date wrapped up? Yeah. It just sounds like, it sounds like everything is going so good for you guys. I'm, I'm so happy for you. You so deserve this. And I know that you know that, but you so deserve this. You so deserve this love and this happiness. And I know that this is something that you were working on for so long. And I'm just like, I'm so happy that you trust me with all of this. And I'm so happy that we got to be on this journey together. And so I'm really excited to hear how the next date goes, because I know it's going to be absolutely magical. Um, but I do have to run because I have my own sexy and amazing, you know, human to get back to. So um, let's catch up soon. Um, we'll talk again pretty soon. And uh, I can't wait to hear more about how the relationship is going. Okay. Yep. Yeah.